The future is bright for women in the modern workspace. Have you despaired that your dream of becoming a female CEO is unattainable? Well, the pattern is changing and you might be the next CEO of your company. Hi everyone, I'm Matt Damlapunar and today I'll talk about the new research on female CEOs in the US workspace. Don't let the fear of losing be greater than the excitement of winning. The boardroom structure is changing. It used to be that board members are chosen from among the ranks of top executives in the company, and they were most often the CEOs of those companies. Also, board experience was a requirement when promoting someone to the role of CEO or hiring a replacement from outside. This made it very challenging for females to come into the picture as most board members and CEOs were male. Recently, new research conducted by an academics from Georgetown University was published in the Harvard Business Review. The study reveals that there will be a significant increase of women in the CEO talent pool in the future. A growing number of women without CEO experience is being invited onto boards. But before I explain further, I'd love you to drop a comment sharing your experience with gender bias in the US C-suite, especially the CEO position. More and more women are being appointed as board members. This is most likely due to the public pressure that big companies should not be steered by men alone. In fact, the US now has women as 24% of board directors and companies that do not diversify are often under scrutiny. On the board, women have access to executive networks such that when companies are on the lookout for candidates for an outside CEO appointment, the names of these women surface. Also, board service provides these women with opportunities to show their leadership abilities and skills to people outside their own firm. So if a woman is keen to lead a company, it's now possible to attain such ambitions by actively seeking board appointments. Thanks for watching and don't forget to follow me or subscribe to the channel. Take care and I'll see you in the next video. Hi everyone, this is Matt Damlapanar. Do you know the difference between data analytics, machine learning or artificial intelligence and how your daily life gets affected with any of those? So you can find out it in the Analytics of Life, which is available at Amazon Kindle Store. Good luck and I hope you enjoy reading it. Take care.